it's your birthday. If We've got a special HBD oh, call for Chito Vera's daughter, Anna. Happy seventh birthday, you little savage. It's that time of year. Prom is on April 21st, and we've got a request from Mick K. Watson asking his love of his life. Caroline, will you go to prom with me? Right next door to the watering hole. Oh, pardon you, is preferred graphics, fine art, and custom framing. Pardon me. If you need some framing, come down, hit up Paul, because he is a savage. Breaking news here out of Nebraska. OC Into News covering the story about this son of a bitch, Nico Jenkins. Four years, and I've struggled for four years. You Fargan Rice old murderer. Today, so no, I don't have anything to say to him. Of brutal murders in 2013 is sentenced to death. Rice hole. First de death penalty imposed since Nebraska Best. voted to bring it back. Yeah. Nico Jenkins had a lot to say in court throughout the last four years, but today he was noticeably quiet. Pun and look who it is. What are we working with today, buddy? This uh, new bike, Trek, full suspension. Just got it. Super sick. Wow. Next level now, huh? So have we sold the other bike? No, we have not. I'll Ryder, come on, we did a whole promotion. How do we not close the deal? Uh, we can sell it right now, $125. All right, he's dropped the price, $125 now. You still wheeling in? Oh. Here comes the wheelie king of California. Ryder throwing it down like a boss. Yeah, Ryder, killing it on his new track with a nose pick. We salute you on this day, Ryder. Ha! This just in, hot off the press. Real news, fake news, or OC Insta news. We've got a breaking story out of Venice Beach. A young man by the name of Colby the Milkman has amputated his own nut. It's there, gang. <laughs> Ten minutes later. Um, my nut still hurt. Got a hole in my pants. Sent it. The backyard debauchery was all fun and games till Colby went home to his mother, complaining about a aching testicle. She looked and the grape was swollen to the size of an apricot and rushed to the hospital. He did not save the nut. Hey, Tina. We got Cheetah there. Everyone's here. Our artist is in the house. Punky. The whole fam's here. Doug man. She's about to bite into a cupcake to determine what sex they're going to have with their child. She's going in for the bite. Oh, Bo's going to actually bite it. What will the flavor be? Looks like, looks like everybody's filming. They've got their intentions. Big bite. We've got more filming going on here. This is great stuff. <laughs> what does it look like? I'm claiming it's a boy. Oh my gosh. Nana's going in for it. Parker's there. This is good stuff here. This is a. Here she goes. Cut it in half. You take a bite. You can do it. Okay, ready? Let's see what's in there. Two, three. It's a girl! Wow! Congratulations, Chloe. This is so exciting. Taylor, we're gonna have another girl in the family. We're gonna bring one too. The Towersy family is growing. Uncle Tito steps up to the pitcher's mound. He's got a fierce opponent at bat. It's Lord Buckington. And here comes the pitch. Down the pipeline. Oh, Buckington gets a piece of that one. Lord Buckington's tapping the plate. He looks aggressive. He fouled the first one off. The second pitch is coming in. It's going to be a heater. And here it comes. He delivers. Oh, and Buckington swings and misses. Oh, he's mad about that one. Get it back over here. Yes. I'm looking him down. I think I'm going to have to give you the old heater knuckleball here. We're going to throw him the knuckler here. Into the pitching stretch, and he comes and delivers. Buckington nails it down the third baseline, but it's a little foul on that one there. Get it back to the pitcher. Right, we've got the cheering section out here to watch young Buckington on this day. He stares down his batter in the box, and here's the pitch. Buck nails it. Yes, what a shot, and the crowd goes wild. Yes, hit it again. Do it. Oh, he's trying to flip it over. He wants to take a different approach to this. Yes, he's samurai stick. Even tougher. What an athlete. 
These kids are great. Investigate, Tito. OC News has been tipped off by Mike Glenn's Facebook page. Apparently, a fentanyl lab was taken down by a hazmat team in Newport Beach Police right next door to Great Max on the peninsula. We salute you, Mike Glenn, for your in-depth investigation on the busted up fentanyl lab. Head over to his Facebook page, check out all these amazing photos, and let's send these methers to jail. This is Uncle Tito, signing off.